Hey, what's up, guys? Stanley Parrish here. Welcome back to the show. I we'll hope you're having a creative day today. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys what I do to my photos and how I export my photos from Photoshop before I upload them to Facebook. So, so let's get right into it. Okay, so number one, the first thing that I do is I make my picture smaller. Uh, when I'm done with all the editing and everything, I flatten the image, then I make it smaller. The first thing I do is I go to Image. I go to image size. You see right now the width is 5593 and the height is 3734 and the resolution is 300. Um, also, where it says resample, I also leave that at bicubic smooth gradients. Because if you leave it at automatic and then you make it smaller, Photoshop is going to sharpen it for you. And we don't want that. So I always leave it at bicubic smooth gradients. I changed my resolution to 72 and I, now I normally use a width of 960 I don't know why um, that works good for me I like it so I set my width to 960 okay resample is set to uh, by cubic smooth gradients I hit OK now we have a smaller image for uploading to Facebook the next thing you want to do is sharpen the image because we didn't let Photoshop sharpen it for us. We, got, we want to sharpen it ourselves. So I'm going to zoom back in to 100%. Okay, I'm going to go to Filter. I'm going to go to Sharpen. Then I'm going to go to Unsharp Mask. Uh, this feature works very great. Um, it's great for sharpening images. Even when you have an image that's kind of blurry or, or, or out of focus, uh, this could possibly save your image. So I'm going to, I normally choose an amount of 200%. The radius, I normally leave it at 0.2. And the threshold, I normally leave it at zero. So I'm going to hit OK. And the next thing that I do is I export it as a PNG. I don't usually save JPEGs uh, for uploading to Facebook. I normally upload PNG files to Facebook. To me, um, you get better quality. Uh, PNGs hold more information than a regular JPEG. Uh, the colors are better. But you, know, you can Google that and find out for yourself. But PNGs work good for me. Okay, so I'm going to go to File, Export, Save for Web. Up here where it says I made a preset up here. But if you don't have a preset, you can go to where it says PNG 24. Okay. PNG 24, make sure that transparency is unchecked. Interlace is not checked. Embed color profile is not checked. Okay, you want to make sure convert to sRGB is checked. And you should be good to go. Do you want to hit save? I'm just going to save this to my desktop. Save it. And there you go. You have your PNG file ready to go. It's going to look good on Facebook. Uh, I don't normally use PNGs when uploading to like my website or anything like that. I normally just use JPEGs when I'm when I'm uploading pictures to my website or any other website. But Facebook, I'm, I'm, this is what I do. I'm, I I upload a PNG file. So, hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Let me know how this works out for you. Let me know if it works for you. It works for me. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button. Drop a comment. Share this video with all your family and friends. And I'll see you on the next one. Thanks, guys.